What up, everybody? I'm here chilling in the garage, pretty much finishing up for the day. Uh, today's Tuesday. I um, got another O ring in there on that power steering line. It's not leaking, but um, power steering isn't really working as it should either. I think I'm just gonna call it quits on that, and that's just gonna have to be one of the downfalls on this thing when I sell it. Uh, got the cool system bled though. Heat's getting hot like it should. So that's cool. I added some, um, I got some of this black heat wrap with the, uh, the new turbo blanket that I just got. So I, uh, stuffed that in a few places on the, um, coolant hoses to try to keep it off the exhaust, keep it from boiling and crazy crap like that. So we're good on that now. Um... Everything else is doing fine as it should. Literally just down to tune it now. I uh, cleaned the inside of the car out and the trunk. Took most of my stuff out. So yeah, we're getting down to the last nitty gritty, man. It's literally just down to tune it now and then clean it up really, really good and get it ready for this weekend. Debating if I want to throw the welds back on it just for looks, for the show. Mostly for the show at work. Not too much for LS Fest, but I don't know. It might leave them on. I kind of don't want to put them on there, though, because I'm going to have the car posted up for sale out there at LS Fest, and I don't want somebody to think that those wheels are coming with it because they're definitely not. I'm keeping them. So I might just say forget it and leave the vet wheels on all the way around. I've had my phone with the world, so it's whatever. I don't know. We'll see what happens once it gets closer. You know how it is. We always change our mind at the last minute. But, um, yeah, man, it's been firing up, sounding fine. Check engine light, but I feel like that's mostly for things that don't exist anymore. So we're just going to have to tune those off, and then we'll be good to go. I am curious to see how this thing is going to drive with this new motor in here. It honestly seems a bit more responsive. Um, the motor, I believe the motor is healthy, though. It's super loud. It seems strong. It revs up pretty good, and there's no tapping, no smoking, no knocking, or nothing like that. So I, I felt pretty decent about it. It's just tuning and getting it cleaned up and be able to get in the boost and stuff like that. So... Hopefully my boy Mark isn't too busy. He can fit me in. We can get this thing pretty decently dialed before this weekend. I'm able to play with it just a little bit before it leaves. But, uh, yeah, that's another thing. Hopefully it doesn't take me long to get rid of this thing. So we can be on to our next build that will be on the channel. And get that bad boy over there assembled and, and put in that car. I'm um, lining up a, a 98, I believe it is, Firebird from a good friend of mine that I bought my second F-Body from. I'm going to be buying this one as well. It's caged. It's a race car. It's a race car. It's light. It's caged. Front end's tubed like this is. And um, yeah, it's just going to be a basic Turbo LS build. It's got a built 4060. I'm going to send it with that fuel system and stuff like that. I got the hot side for a turbo kick. I get a turbo. I got wastegate, got a full off valve. Got to make a cold side and a cooler stuff like that. I'll see how far I get into it. I really don't want to sit on it for too long because I have my eyes on another build after that. And I'm not really a fan of Firebird. So we'll, uh, we'll see how far into the fiber we get before we push it off and sell it. I don't know if I'm going to make it run to drive or if I'm just going to put most of it together and let somebody finish it and grab it. I don't know. We'll see. We'll see. But for right now, I'm just glad that this thing here is done and it just needs tuning. And we got a couple days to spare for the show. So big ups on that. Just wish me luck on trying to sell this thing and that the tuning goes well and we can get old girl up out of here. And on to the next toy. Till then, later.